Have you ever seen one of these? These, I have, as you see, four of them. Can you see them on the bed? I have four of them. I actually have five, but one's probably on the floor or somewhere hidden. But, all right, being a quad, um, I get burning in my legs and you get spasms all the time. So I have one of these on me pretty much 24 hours a day. You know, it fits, I call this its hole. Fits right there in the side and it doesn't fall out. I take it to doctor's appointments with me. I take it to friends' houses. I have it in the van when I'm driving. But uh, yeah, so I like to dig it into my legs as much as I can. You know, even, even if you're not paralyzed, these babies help. You know, I got three ways that I use this. You wanna wanna see my secrets? You know, you can do it like this. Otherwise, I flip it over and I can have it on the back of my hand. And then, as I said, I have four. That's because I drop these babies all the time. Wanna know my third secret? This is the guarantee so you don't drop it. You got full power then, it's kinda nice. You know, I'll dig into my arms with it. It helps like before I exercise and stuff too, you know. I'll flip my arm up and get around the back. And I spasm sometimes down here and like twitch. So I'll get into there. But uh, I like to dig in up here. And then too when I lay down, um, I'm going to do a video on that because I got a couple different tools that I use. I use it in my belly to like get rid of my gas. Like being a quad, I don't understand if it's because our muscles, but yeah. You know, I, you can get these on Amazon. There, you can get you can get one for like ten bucks, or you can get them on Wish. Or if you got a Sam's Club membership, you can get two of them for like twelve bucks. But uh, yeah, I showed my doctor this the other day, and I had her use it, and she's like, "Holy crap!" Like I need to buy one of them. I told her she can keep one, one in her car, you know, and one in her uh, one in the couch right next to her. But uh, yeah, I also like with this. Once I get in my chair, I love to stretch my back forward. It takes away quite a bit, quite a few spasms and it helps with the quadriplegic belly, but it can always flip this around and to like help loosen muscles up, I like to dig into the back of there. You can get weighed on by like the back of your butt too. And like with having my wheelchair, hold on, I'm gonna whip it shitty a little bit. With having my chair, the backrest actually like helps shove your hand deeper into your back. I don't recommend keeping it on the ponytail when you do in the back, but you know, see, I'll still flip it over. But uh, you just gotta be careful you don't lose it back there because sometimes it'll get stuck. And then I get the Theracane out and then I'll pull it out with that. I haven't devised something yet to make it tight enough to stay on my broomstick because I wanna be able to roller my legs with it. You know, I'll have my nurses go through and do my legs in bed. But yeah, I absolutely love these. And like I said, I got four of them. But uh, if you do end up getting one of these, um, it's wise to pop these balls out. Um, maybe like once a month. Because you get dead skin cells under there. Just so you know the thing that works the best for that. Because some people will try to put a knife underneath there. And it ends up gouging the sides of the plastic. And then it will scratch you. The thing that works best is a tiny Allen wrench. Just so you know. But uh, yeah. Now, the reason why I have four of them, besides dropping them, is because after multiple uses, you got to come close, Gianetta. After multiple uses, you see how they get broken? It all depends on how strong your workers are, too. Because this one, as you see, like, once your handle breaks, we just used a, a bread tie. Some electrical tape kind of sucks. But this one did the same thing. Hold on. This one, you know, cut here on the side. But yeah, like I said, it's wise to pop them balls out, get your dead skin out of there, use a toothbrush and an Allen wrench. But yeah, I I use two of them sometimes at the same time. You know? This arm, I don't have much of a tricep, so it's a little harder to press. But I've learned if you lean forward, not having your tricep, you know, it ends up you're able to just, I don't know, use your body weight or whatever. But yeah. So, you want to get rid of some of your burning if you're a quad, help with your spasms. You know, like I said, I bring it with me. Got one with me 24 hours a day. I keep one in my bed. It's kind of funny, my nurse always tries to give me a spare when I'm in bed. I don't drop them when I'm in my bed. You know, I'll put it like sideways right there, you know, up in the bed so I can just scoop my thumb in it and pick it up. But, yeah. 
I don't know. So I suppose I feel like I talk too much and I got I, I got I got another video or two I want to do. So talk to you later.